Hey, what's up? I am Lucid and welcome back to Minecraft. So I'm kind of kind of stuck right here and I just paused my game because I was AFKing at the zombie grinder and I accidentally set all these guys free as I was about to kill them. So it looks like there's just like two here, right? But watch, this is what's going to happen when I press back to game. Whoa, there's so many of them. Holy crap. And there's more over here too. So I think it's time that I escape before all these guys freaking kill me. Uh-oh. Alright, I gotta make it here, close this. Ha! They can't reach me now. Oh wait! Ooh, almost let that guy in. What now, dude? Get out of here. So I have no idea how to deal with this. My base, my mountain base is like infested with zombies right now. How, what the heck am I even supposed to do about this? I don't even know. I mean, I don't think they're gonna just des despawn. Uh, let me jump into this shallow, well it's not really shallow, let me jump into this pool of water here that I always jump into. And what the heck? Did I just see a zombie here? Whoa, there's a baby zombie here. Uh oh, he's after me. Ooh, I don't want him to hit me, what the heck? Oh, and now I'm going back into the big old zombie infestation. Holy crap, man. What am I even supposed to do about this? That kind of ruined things a bit. Look at this. Whoa, he still hit me. My base is infested with zombies. And I don't even think I closed the trap door in there, so like all of them are just going to get out. Ugh. So it looks like I'm going to have to leave this area. <laughs> what the heck? You know what? Let's be brave and get a thumbnail. Let me go F11 right now. Whoa. Never mind, that's a bad idea. Whoa, he's gonna break my door down. Never mind. You know what? We're gonna get out of here. Never mind. Let's get out of here. <laughs> so, one thing I haven't done in a while is go exploring. And I don't know if you guys remember, but I did get a new horse after my original one died. And this one's just kind of been sitting here because I never use it. I have like no reason to use the horse at all. But since our since the mountain base is freaking infested with zombies, what better time than now to go on a little bit of an exploration exploration episode? Yeah, let's go... Whoa, uh -oh, I think I, I just lost my horse. Oh, never mind. Let's go exploring. So I've pretty much been in like that direction all the way. And it's about to turn night. But you know what? Look at all those zombies up there. I don't even want to deal with them. I'm not going to kill them all. There's like at least 300. I'm pretty sure. Let's check this out. Where's the entities? Oh, well, I guess I moved far away enough for them to despawn a bit. But there was like 300 or something inside that area where I was collecting them before I accidentally opened it. So yeah, what was I saying? I've already been like in that direction, so let's go in this direction this time. I don't think I've been this way, right? Or at least I don't remember going this way. And this horse is only decent. It's not like super great or anything, but that's okay. It runs at a decent pace, so that's good enough for me. And wow, that's a nice looking hill. I don't need any more hills though, since I already have my base set up in one. And okay, it would have been nice if it was more forest around my area instead of plains and desert. But oh well, maybe I'll find a new place in the future. And I actually don't want to generate too much, too many chunks because I know that there's a new update, whoa, a new update coming and there's like new stuff that can generate so I want to be kind of careful about that. So let's set a limit, let's say. And actually, now that I think of it, I, I probably have been this way because I remember seeing the snow and the lava. But let's keep going. Oh yeah, I totally went this way before, I just didn't go that far. Uh, Let's go in this direction for... Let's say to the max 1,500 on the X. That way I don't go too far. I'm pretty sure this is all going to be mountains. It'd be might nice if I could find some dark oak. That's kind of that's kind of a block that I'd like to have. Okay, I'm going to close this. And what the heck? I'm totally stuck here. Oh, never mind. All right. So let's go in between this mountain, these two mountains. And whoa, my horse took damage there. It's okay, man. This is not good terrain for a horse. You should use a horse for like. Wow, that's a cool waterfall. And it just generated too. What was I saying? You should use a horse for like... 
exploring flat areas, not like these super hilly mountains. I don't think I can traverse this, that's why. Let's see, maybe I can jump up here. This horse does jump pretty high, that's why I chose it. Okay, hopefully no mobs get me. Huh, there's a there's two creepers there. I don't want to deal with those guys for sure. That would suck if they killed this horse. His HP is just so low. Okay, and it looks like we got a birch forest there too. That's interesting. Maybe I can find some dogs. Do I have any bones? No, I don't. Ah, dang it, that sucks. Actually, oh, I should have brought the ender pearls, huh? Maybe we could have found the stronghold. Oh well. I also want to find a, a swamp if I can. Okay, this is just going to be a bad fall. I want to find a swamp because, oh crap, I want to get some lily pads for the sugar cane. But if I can't, that's okay too. I can always use wool, it's just it doesn't look as cool as, as what's it called? Lily pads. But okay. There's a lava pool here. That tree is totally going to catch on fire, I bet. And it doesn't look like there's anything here. I would have liked to find an ocean or something. That would have been cool if we could find, like, one of those ocean monuments. I haven't been getting any interesting biomes besides that clay biome. I forgot what that's called, but the one with the hardened clay and, oh crap, I keep dropping my horse. Come on, horse, what are you doing? And holy crap, we're already almost at X1500. Whoa, don't go back there. Huh. So it looks like I traveled a fair bit already. That kind of sucks. I didn't really get anywhere. Uh, and I lost my horse again. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's just keep going. You know, it's fine for you guys because you don't have to walk back, but I have to walk all the way back off camera later. Okay, this zombie wants to fight me. What the heck, man? I'm so not used to riding a horse. Alright, and I've already hit the limit I set for myself. But you know what? It's okay. Because I think I see a swamp biome now. And oh yeah, I totally do. Okay, we can totally get some lily pads. And this skeleton's gonna want to fight me, and I don't want to fight him. Ah uh, yes, lily pads ready. So how do I do this? This is kind of dangerous. If I fall, then I lose my horse again. Ah, You know what? I should have brought some leads with me. It's kind of stupid that I didn't. Let's get back on. This is not good horsing environment, if that even is a word. I don't think it is though, and I should have brought shears too actually. And oh hey, it's these blue flower things. These look cool. I forgot what they're called, and I can't break them. Ah, blue orchids. So I'm going to grab some of that. Why not? And I, I gotta be wary of creepers. Because I don't want to take damage from... I don't want my horse to get blown up by it. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can take a creeper blast, but I don't think my horse can. I'm just gonna collect all these lily pads if I can. And I'll just leave my horse there, I suppose. Maybe I'll drop a torch or something. And I know, like, I'm probably gonna need so many lily pads if I wanna... Actually have this work. And okay, there's a zombie after me. I don't really care, he can't catch me, I'm too fast. No, I'm not. Uh-oh, there's that creeper. Okay. So it's times like this where it's good that I have a bow capable of killing creepers in one shot. Haha. <laughs> oh, and there's a big slime there too. You know what? I'm gonna go kill that because I've been having terrible luck finding slime balls. And yeah, I see those creepers over there too. Go away, creeper. Whoa. They're totally gonna blow up. Uh-oh, this is not good. This is not good. Alright, that's fine. Let me kill these guys, though. Give me your slime balls. Oh, yeah. Dude, these giant slimes, they give so many slime balls, and I want to collect these lily pads, too. If I can, and I probably shouldn't be using my sword. So I'll switch out of that. I hope a creeper doesn't drop on me. So... Okay, there's my horse, and there's a spider. I guess spiders get trapped by the vines, which is pretty nice. And okay, I guess it's a full moon now, huh? Oh, no, it's not. Huh, for some reason I thought slimes could only spawn in a full moon and during the 
in the swamps. But I guess I was misinformed or something. And I got 20 slime balls out of that, which is really great. So I'm going to go hunt some more slimes and collect these lily pads while I'm on the way of doing things. Hopefully no creepers get me. I'll also take some of these blue orchids too. If I can break them. Whoa, and I'm super hungry. I just noticed that. And there's also a zombie after me. So let's see. I'll kill that guy first because they do some damage. And I actually didn't repair my iron armor last episode, which is why I was still kind of going for uh, levels when I already when I already did that whole enchanting episode. But it should be fine. They should still last. Maybe not my helmet. And this guy can't even hurt me anymore. But I'm still going to kill him. Because he has a chance of giving me slime balls, which is what I want. I also should remember where my horse is. I don't want to accidentally lose my horse. It took me forever to get that horse. There's just a lot of random horsing around. Ha! Huh. Oh man, I'm hilarious. <laughs> what the heck? Okay. Anyways. Oh, creeper. So this guy's going to take an arrow to the face, and that did not kill him. Whoa. Alright. More lily pads. I don't know how many stacks I'm going to need, but probably a couple. So this is going to be interesting. I didn't know they spawned like that. I always thought it was like more open water. I guess they changed the layout of the swamps. And there's an enderman here. So no reason not to fight this guy. There's also a baby zombie after me. But that guy's dead. I got rid of that enderman pretty fast. I wonder how many pearls he dropped. I don't even know. And I, there's still some lingering sounds for some reason. Okay, well that's scary. And it's actually almost turning day. And I don't know how well you guys can see this. It's probably really dark, huh? I probably shouldn't have done this during the day. I mean during the night. And uh, I guess I should have lit things up as I was going. So I apologize if it's a bit too dark. I just realized now because I can actually see it pretty well through my monitor. But I know it gets a little bit darker when I record. Okay, I've just been collecting these on the way. It's turning day, so I should probably find the rest of the slimes if I can get them. Instead of going after all these freaking lily pads. How many do I even have? Almost two stacks. That's that's great. That's exactly what I need. Oh man, I've been wanting these for so long. It's great to actually finally get them. It's great to finally get them is what I should say. Not actually finally. Okay, there's a zombie there, there's a cow here, there's a zombie coming after me in the water. Good thing they move slower, so I can just run away. And I want to grab these blue orchids too, because they look pretty cool. I like them. Okay, where are the slimes at? And what the heck just hit me? This guy just shoot me with an arrow? Wow, good aim, man. Better than me. I totally lost my horse, guys. Oh, no, never mind. I see it over there. And I'm so glad I have these boots with Depth Strider. They are amazing, and I think I named them Shoes, because I always call them Shoes. Alright, you want to fight, dude? Oh yeah, I just one-shotted you, because you suck. That or my bow is too strong. <laughs> Anyways. Huh, where's my horse? I gotta remember that it's like over here, and I see this creeper here. And he probably wants to fight too. And that did not kill it in one shot like I thought it would, but that's okay because it's dead now and usually I don't like to destroy the environment so much too much but getting lily pads isn't really that bad because there's just so many of them now I guess but they're not exactly rare anymore so it's nice to have these they're kind of a, like a biome specific resource and where did that giant slime go I, I could have sworn there was a big slime here I guess not though huh it would have been nice to bring some shears too that way I could get myself some vines, but I know that there's a jungle nearby somewhere where I can grab vines from, so I should be good in that department. And okay, there's some sheep here. I don't need to worry about sheep. The one animal that I haven't gotten yet is our chickens, I should say. I haven't found any chickens yet besides in the nether and like the, the occasional chicken that spawns in the zombie grinder, which is kind of weird. I think that's from like chicken jockeys with the the baby zombies. I think that's what's spawning them. So I have a couple pieces of chicken and I can't, I wish I could 
No, actually, I think they just drown and then the zombie picks up like the chicken meat. It would be great if I could like actually extract chickens from that or something. Because then I could have a chicken farm. I just need one chicken to start laying me eggs and slowly, eventually, I'll have two chickens, I hope. I'd assume that's how it works. That's how I got started a bunch of times before. And Okay, how many do I have now? Eh, a decent amount. And I got like 23 of these flowers. Maybe we'll find some chickens eventually. It can't be that hard, right? I know there's chickens in the jungles too. So I might look in the jungle for those. And okay. How many more lily pads should I get? There's just so many more here. I think it's time to turn back, but I'll take a different route back. Maybe we'll traverse the desert. Just so I have a chance of finding maybe like some kind of structure or something. I've been getting pretty lucky in the desert with finding structures. Okay, I'm going to call it. This is about it for the lily pads. How many do I have? Ah, uh, let's cap out on the stack. Why not? Let's get... Let's get this last stack filled to 64. Okay, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58. I should have brought an ender chest with me. 59, 60, 61, 62. And there's one in the water here. Perfect. Oh, no, not perfect. I'm pretty sure there'll be one more by the horse somewhere. So let's head back to the horse. And okay, I got 24 blue orchids too. That's nice. And I almost just jumped straight into the lava there. That would have been pretty bad. I'm pretty sure I would have taken some substantial damage. Which is never good. And it probably would have destroyed my helmet. And there's some more blue orchids here. So I'm going to take these. And I don't know why I didn't pick that one off of up off the ground. Hopefully my horse is still doing well. It is. So I'm going to grab one last lily pad. We're going to get on this horse and head back. I'm pretty sure this is the direction I came from. And wow, look at all these lily pads. I might have to come back here to get them if I need them in the future. And I'm pretty sure I came from this way. Yeah. Okay, I'm totally going to lose my horse here. Yep. I guess I'll just have to push him over. And let's go across that desert that we're... I'm pretty sure I'm going to come across a desert if I was remembering correctly. And man, this guy's kind of stupid. Stupid horse. Alright. So I'm going to head back. Oh, hey, chickens. And eggs. Oh, that's great. Give me your eggs, chicken. Three. Do you have an egg for me? Huh. I was just talking about not finding any chickens. Hopefully from these four eggs I can get at least one chicken. Because if I get at least one chicken, then I can start my own chicken farm. That'd be great. Okay, more bodies of water here. I can't actually jump across. Oh man, I'm going to have to push the horse. This horse is kind of useless. And more forest. Oh man, it was such a bad idea to bring a horse with me. I should have just walked it. Horses aren't that great for everything, I would say. And huh, some interesting flowers here. Don't mind if I do. How did I only get two? I thought I grabbed three. So I'm just... Whoa, that would have been bad. I'm just grabbing some extra stuff to build with. Just in case I ever want to build with any of them. And where was that desert I'm talk I was talking about? Am I remembering correctly? incorrectly? I don't know. But this episode is starting to get long too. I think I just spent most of it fighting in the swamp and collecting like lily pads and stuff so that's this was kind of a boring episode huh and i've been saying that a lot lately i need to work on things things better if i keep thinking everything's boring then what the heck are you, do you guys think about it right and wow that's another cool waterfall i think i'm spawning too many new chunks am i even going in the right direction i should be yeah as long as the x is getting small then i'm good and okay, I don't want to accidentally damage myself here. And where is the desert? I thought there was a desert somewhere to my, what would be my right right now. But it doesn't look like there's any. Oh no, we made it back already. Crap. Man, see, this is why I should have really brought some shears. Because that way I could grab some of these things. Whatever the heck they're called. I'm pretty sure you can't regrow those either. And okay, I don't think I have time to even explore the desert. 
even if I do find one. What was that? Oh, it's rabbits. Oh yeah, and I should breed some rabbits too. Get some rabbit feet to make those jumping potions or whatever the heck you use rabbit feet for. Rabbit foot? Lucky rabbit's foot? I don't know. Okay, I know where we are right now. It looks like I didn't really traverse that mountain. And huh, there is desert over here. That is strange. I remember one time that one time before I recorded episode 30, I think, I remember I still had my horse because my horse was dead by episode 30. That much I remember for sure. But I did go exploring with it and I was going through a desert and I remember coming across a temple, but I didn't have any space, so I didn't even bother checking what was in it. And that might have been a mistake because there probably was some like diamonds or something. And I think by episode 30, I was already kind of well established, so I didn't even really need any diamonds. And I still don't really need any diamonds now, huh? Well, I have a decent amount, I'd say. How many do I have? I had like 30 last episode, right? And wow, I didn't know clay could go into those colors naturally. But I think it changes as you dig down into it. And okay, we did come across the desert. Where the heck is my home? Never mind, I lied. I don't know where we're at, where we're at at all, but that hill looks kind of familiar. And so does that. I think we passed that on our way here right? Huh. I should have probably cut all this out too. <laughs> but you guys know me, I'm too lazy to do that. For the most part, I do do it sometimes, occasionally. I should do it more often though. But it kind of makes it feel like, why the heck did I waste my time doing, talking over it? And whoa, I don't want to go in there because the horse cannot traverse water easily. And hey, there's the mountain base. That's beautiful. Beautiful. So I'm just going to jump across this small pool of water, because this horse cannot walk through water at all. And you know what? To end things off, I don't, I don't even want to bring the horse back over to the horse area. Let's see if I have enough lily pads to actually do this. I guess the horse can just stay there. Can you place lily pads on top of, on top of water that's moving? No, you can't. But I can do this. Finally. Oh man, that's a weird sound. Okay, I'll do all this off camera. Now I don't have to walk in the water every time I want to collect the lily pads. Okay, let's just investigate one thing before I end this episode off. And that. I'll go recollect my horse later too. But I want to see if the zombies are still here. Okay, this is kind of scary. I don't think they'd be here, I think they'd despawn. Yep. oh, okay, finally, we're free of them. And I should quickly go turn this thing off. Oh, it's off already, and I closed the trap door too. Okay, well, I'm gonna end it off here, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a thumbs up and or subscribing. I do read all comments, so feel free to leave one. And yeah, hopefully we do something more interesting next episode. So yeah, thanks for watching, see ya.